Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Digi and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get all the current Smiling Critter badges in this game. But before I keep going, shout out of the day goes to Festive Halo Jer. Thank you for being first at commenting first. Sweet Sheep, open up teleport, scroll down to mountain. Then you're going to turn around and head over this way towards this, I guess, lake of sorts. And you're gonna go up this mountain right over here. I know, we get to go on this ice and the snow. It's very Christmassy. We love it. Now we just need to find Santa. All right, so go up the mountain like so, and we're gonna kind of go off to the right side. And when you come up and over, what you're gonna do is look for this part over, where's the water? Oh, there's the water, right over here. And kind of do a little drop on down, boop. Once you're, whoa, sliding. Bro, ew, let me in the water. All right, once you're in the water, you're then gonna swim down and head over this way. Now, what's interesting is you can actually swim up and then just go over here, step on the ice, then go to this, and then there should be a little gap here. You can just drop down, but you can also do it by swimming through the water like so, like that. But this just allows you to Ignore the water. Go through the door, and there is sweet sheep. Go ahead, bump into them, and there you go. Rejoin if you got the badge, and check your morphs menu. Okay. Scary catnap. So, you can actually just go here into the house if you want, or open up teleport, scroll down, and go to bedrooms. Once you're here, you're going to turn around, and there is going to be scary catnap. Go ahead, interact with it. I already got it, but that's all you got to do cartoon catnap so you can either enter through the main door or start at bedrooms and go down the stairs but i think this is a little easier right here is the basement door head downstairs like so then you're gonna go through this side on the left then go one two go forward and there is going to be a catnap cartoon picture go ahead and get it i don't know why it's not giving it to me Cleaning glass. This one's super easy, but I recommend either going to a brand new server or a private server to do this because if you go to a public one, it will be clean. All you gotta do is just clean the glass and there you go. Ta-da! And look, it's all pretty. There's also multiple spots as well. So if one glass is clean, then there will be more. There's one there. I believe those are the only ones in the house. Mini game one. Go over here, <coughs> over here. Go to the basement, all right? <clears throat> Down this way, over here. And then there's a vent. Open it up, and then there's gonna be a vent tunnel. We're gonna go through it, open up this side, and this is where all the mini games are. So one, two, and three. Number one, dodge catnap from seeing you. Bump into it, it will then send you into a public one, maybe, or not. And now, we just gotta get through it. Now, what you're trying to do is when you hide behind these things, Catnap will then do like this red attack vision thing. And you've gotta be right here behind any of these bookshelves, chests, anything that's essentially protecting you from his vision. Now, if you die, you just simply get sent back to the start and you gotta make your way back across. Super simple. Um, there we go. Wait for it and walk across. And once you pretty much get to this big area, it will then give you the badge and even a notification. That's so cool. Mini game two. So, same thing. Head down this way. Go to the basement like a so. Bada beam, bada boom. We're gonna go over here. Now, mini game number two is gonna be over this side. Now, what we gotta do is touch all the black platforms and turn them to green while surviving catnaps um you know killings <laughs> so here we go once you're here you've got beds all around the map and these are the platforms now what you're trying to do is turn all these on without dying now i do recommend turning on sounds so i'm going to do that right now because it actually gives you a notification there we go now, make sure you are on the bed when this happens, all right? You're pretending to sleep, okay? You're not really asleep, honestly. 
So I'm gonna go here and then you all had to lay down. Just letting you know. There we go. Gotta wait. Wait for it. Ah! <laughs> I don't want to go to bed. You can't make me, Mom. I do what I want. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Boom. And I believe, yep, we have one more. I'm glad to go. I'm gonna die. Oh! <laughs> Yo! I was a little too close for comfort, my friend. Alright, then the door is gonna open. And then we're gonna head over. I don't know if I'll make it. Will I make it? Oh, I'll make it. There we go. 150 play coins. And then just bump into it. Sends you back. Mini game three. Over this way. Go over here. The same way as usual. Down into the basement. Down into the vent. Through the vent shaft. And out the vent shaft. Into mini game number three. Join the game and try searching for how to play. Well, good thing I know how to. Because all you gotta do is cheat yeah right here your work and what you're gonna do hold this down but you gotta make sure catnap is not around there we go oh, oh no i messed up so when you hear the bell catnap comes in no more cheating stop cheating because then you will die so this one takes quite a while but it's pretty straightforward you got one two three four five books to cheat from um i don't know how you're cheating because there's no one in this classroom but I simply just cheat and then complete all the books see how it disappeared that means you did it you got it and now you just gotta wait so i'll just cut to the end and i'll see you guys in just a bit now if you die which i did i was a little uh too fast um you actually have your progress saved so i had two done there and I was in the middle of doing one. It does save your progress. I don't know how many times, though, you can die before it completely restarts you. So, try not dying. Alright, there we go. Head over this way. And now, you will get the badge. Oh, hello, kitty. Bye, kitty. <laughs> and bump into it and get sent back to the main game. Mini game obby. So, what you're going to do, back again this way. But there is a slight difference with mini game obby. Head downstairs. Go through the vent like so just like normal but there's a difference look to your left and you're gonna see the mini game obby over here now you're gonna go ahead bump into it like normal get teleported to the mini game obby and there it is now it's actually not a really hard obby i already completed it but it's pretty straightforward you jump around the stars or checkpoints avoid these spinning death traps avoid the hammers and then get to the end and bump into the doorway. Very straightforward. I really don't want to do it because I already did it. So, simple as that. Just avoid being hit. You're good to go. Dog Day Cartoon. So, we're going to have to do one thing first. Get a shovel, which is going to be over here, down in the basement. Go down the stairs. You may have seen it before, but if you head over this way, then all the way here to the right, it's by the cartoon cat um, badge. See, there it is. Ta-da. All right. So once you have your shovel, it's in your inventory. We're going to go ahead, open up, teleport, scroll on down to mountain. Once you're here at mountain, look over here for the big pile of dirt. Kind of looks like poop. Um, don't worry. We're not digging in poo. But you're going to go here, use the shovel to dig it up, and boom, there is a bone. However... We still need to do some more things. Take this bone back to the Smiling Critter's home. Go ahead, walk inside, head into the kitchen where you're going to see a table with Dog Day's food bowl? Dog bowl? And go ahead, put the bone in it, and you should then get the badge. Catnap Plush. Open up Teleport. Scroll all the way down to Art Zone. Once you're here, turn around, and there is going to be a picture of plush cat go ahead and interact with it there you go all right and those are all the badges today if you want to check out the badge morphs just go here into morphs i believe let me just double check there's nothing here yeah go to morphs and here they are their santa dog day is limited by the way so you want to get this during december if you want a limited time morph but other than that 
you know, we got the sweet sheep right there. Then we've got, you know, scary catnap. We got so many. We got cartoon, which is probably the coolest morph. I think this is what everyone really likes is getting the cartoon catnap. Because it actually looks like the morph itself. Other than that, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe down below, and join the Bad Chunting Squad today. Use star code Digi whenever you buy Robux or Premium. And as always, stay awesome, stay cool. Good luck, Bad Chunting. Bye-bye.